My name is Daniel Spielman. I'm a professor at Yale, and I'm a theoretical computer scientist specializing in the design of algorithms. I try to think of new ways to solve algorithmic problems, usually trying to come up with either faster ways to solve problems or more efficient ways or ways that give more accurate answers. I think the moment when I figured out that I really wanted to study math and algorithms was when I would ever get puzzles as a child, or at least as a teenager. And rather than actually trying to solve the puzzle myself, I found it much more fun to try to get my computer to solve it for me. Problems in algorithm design, I think, most fascinate me because of this idea that by coming up with a new way of solving something that you already know how to do, you can do it better. It's very thrilling because you get to use just pure reasoning, just thinking about mathematics, to come up with actually better ways of doing things. And then those better ways of doing things enable people in the real world to do things differently. They change what you can actually compute. My work in coding theory has focused on the design of error correcting codes that can be encoded and decoded quickly. Error correcting codes are the technology that we use to transmit information so that even if part of it is corrupted, we can still recover the information. The real challenge was to come up with algorithms that could very quickly process the data to recover from the errors. And the same sort of ideas are used in almost all communication devices. So if you think about your cell phone, the main limiting factor in the speed at which your cell phone can communicate is the amount of interference that it has when it communicates. The way you deal with that is through error correcting codes. I spend a lot of time doing math. In my spare moments, I am likely to be found sitting thinking about math. As a matter of fact, I have no idea what other people sit and think about when they're on a beach. But for me, it's usually sitting thinking about math or my research. It's what my brain tends to do. It's the way I like to fall asleep at night, is thinking about a hard problem. If it's hard enough, you run out of ideas and you fall asleep. It's a huge honor to be awarded a MacArthur Fellowship. It's something that I always hope to be worthy of. I, I admit it's difficult to feel worthy of it, but I hope that over the next five years, what I do with it certainly does justify it. I imagine that I'll be able to spend much more time on my research, and I also hope it will bring some more attention to my field and my discipline, and maybe encourage some more people to come along and study with me. Mm -hmm.